Idris Elba and his wife Sabrina exchanged a kiss while attending the Gucci and Cora show at Milan Fashion Week on Friday. The actor and the Canadian model showcased their affection in a photo session before the menswear fall winter 2024-2025 catwalk for the brand. Idris displayed his refined sense of style, donning a trench coat adorned with a motif and paired with loose-fitting jeans. Completing his ensemble, he added oversized sunglasses, patent boots, and a brown leather belt. Sabrina looked stunning in a backless crop top adorned with multicolored embellishments, paired with bleached jeans. Adding the finishing touches to her outfit, the model complemented her look with a coordinating handbag and introduced a pop of color with a pair of burgundy stilettos. The much-anticipated event commenced with Gucci's creative director, Sabato de Sarno launching the Encora campaign, marking his debut in the realm of men's shows. In November Gucci's fashion house in Rome witnessed a strike staged by designers who opposed the company's choice to relocate its design office from the Italian capital to Milan. Employees argue that the decision to shift 153 out of 219 workers 400 miles north by March of the following year is tantamount to dismissal for many individuals connected to the city. Demonstrators gathered outside the Gucci offices, brandishing banners bearing messages such as Gucci cut, but doesn't so, and at Gucci, redundancy is fashionable. Approximately 50 individuals participated in the four-hour strike on Monday, representing the inaugural instance of industrial action by creative professionals in Gucci's 102-year history. Union representatives allege that Kiering, the French owner of Gucci, is undergoing a restructuring process aimed at reducing staff, ultimately affecting individuals with responsibilities in the capital. Gucci communicated this decision to unions in October, stating its intention to relocate nearly 70% of the staff in Rome to Lombardy by March of the following year. But labor union Jill's regional office said Gucci's decision was not supported by objective reasons, making hard not to think the real goal was to cut staff. Let us know what do you think. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and thanks for watching.